Hello Glamours and welcome back to my channel and if you are new to my channel thank you so much for stopping by now don't forget to click on the subscribe button and the notification bell for more upcoming DIY future videos. For this DIY, I'll be making nail polish dip his and hers desk table lamps. If you would like to find out what I created, just continue watching. To start off, I'll be making the lampshades and I'll start by using three garden dish and I'll spray paint just the inside with white spray paint. And don't forget to follow me on my social media platforms linked below. Next, I'll be using a plastic storage bin filled up almost to the top with room temperature water. And I'll be using it to dip my garden dish. I'll be using metallic gold, silver, and black nail polish. I'll be starting off with the metallic gold and I'll just be adding drops of nail polish into the water and as you can see, it floats on top of the water and it spreads out. Next, I'll be repeating the same steps with the black nail polish and you could add as much as you like or less. And I repeated the same steps with the metallic silver. I'll be repeating the same steps with the gold and silver glitter glue. I'll have a complete list of all items used in the description bar below. Next I'll take my dish and I'll flip it deep side down and then I'll push it into the water gently and I'll bring it back up gently as well. Before I let it dry I'll clean up the edges and once it's dry this will be a marble effect. Before I continue on the next, I'll take a strainer and I'll clean up what remains in the water. Next, I'll continue the same steps with all three nail polish in no particular order. And keep in mind, you may add as much nail polish as you like or less. Once I was done, I let all three dry for 24 hours. Once it was dry, I applied three coats of Mod Podge spray to seal it in. Next, I'll be working on the lamp bases and I'll start off with three wooden rods. Next, I took all three wooden rods and I'll be placing them next to each other two inches lower from each other. Once I was done, I took my ruler and I placed markings so I may cut them evenly and the measurements are 20, 18, and 16 inches. Next, I'll take all three rods and paint two coats of white acrylic paint. Next, I'll be using these four inches wooden circles and they come six in a pack, but I will only be using three and I will also paint them with white acrylic paint on both sides. I will also be using three seven inch wooden plaques and I will paint them with white acrylic paint on one side. Next, I'll be using this four pack of metallic bowls and I'll only be using three. Next, I'll take them and flip them upside down and I'll take a piece of the wooden rod that I cut off and I'll trace a circle in the center on all three. Next, I'll cut out the circle on all three using my soldering iron. the remainder of this DIY, I'll be using my strongest glue sticks. Next, I took my wooden rod and I insert it into the center of the circle that I cut out on the bowl and then I apply hot glue on the wooden rod, place it in the center of the seven inch wooden plaque. And for extra hold, I apply hot glue around the wooden rod and also around the bowl.
Next, I'll be using mini self-adhesive mosaic stickers, and I'll cut it in half with remaining of 16 rolls. Then I'll peel the back and place it in the center of the rod. I also use three rolls of mosaic stickers, and I place one on each end of the rod. I also apply single strips of mosaic stickers around the bowl and I also repeat the same steps around the wooden plaque. Next I'll bring back my 4 inch wooden circles and I'll apply hot glue in the center and then I'll glue it on to the opposite end of the wooden rod. Next, I'll bring back my garden dish and I'll flip it upside down and then I'll apply hot glue in the center and I'll glue on my lamp base. And for lighting on each lamp, I'll be using two remote LED touch lights. And here's the finished looks. I really do love the way all three turned out. What I love the most is the unique style and the different heights. This is a very budget friendly idea if you have kids going off to college. These lamps can be used as a set or individually to be placed on top of a computer desk or a nightstand. And with this beautiful lighting you could place these in any room in your home. And again you could use it as a set or as a single lamp. And as a reminder these can be made in any color of your choice. Here are two other DIYs where I use the same technique for nail polish dip to make beautiful home decor and I'll have these videos linked below. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this DIY as much as I enjoyed creating it. Now don't forget I post new DIY videos every week. Like and share with family and friends and subscribe if you haven't. Comment if you wish. Turn on your notification bells for more upcoming future videos. I'll see you on my next DIY upload.